Okay, so uh, twin screw compounding extruders are typically used for continuous mixing of polymers, additives, colorants, fillers, modifiers, uh, generally used to create a value added intermediate pellet, although uh, in some instances we can bypass the pelletizing step and go directly to a finished product such as sheet, film, fiber, or profile. Uh, so the benefits of bypassing the pelletizing step and going directly to the, uh, to the end product, uh, there uh, is typically cost savings associated with bypa bypassing that pelletizing step. And in virtually all instances, the, uh, the end product benefits by uh, increased uh, properties, uh, by the reduction of uh, at least one additional heat and shear history. So a few of the, the latest trends or the hot topics uh, in the twin screw business these days. Uh, a lot of activity around uh, bio, bioplastics, biopolymers. Uh, we're seeing a, a huge uptake in recycling activities. Of course, uh, every day there are new thermoplastic composites being developed, a majority of these being developed on twin screw compounding extruders. And then, of course, we've got some traditionally strong markets such as color and additive master batch, uh, highly filled compounding, uh, reactive extrusion, and devolatilization.